Thursday, September the 23rd, and we're getting our last little walk in around the beach. But this is an interesting palm tree because it kind of looks almost like a bamboo. Here's some more of it along here. There's an, another uh, plant. It looks like it comes from a bulb. They're all over the place. I'm going to take a picture of this plant, which is quite unusual because half of it's blue and half of it's purple and half green. It kind of looks something like a yucca, but it feels uh, soft. Here's one of the houses that we pass on the way back home from uh, going down to the beach at the far end of the resort. The front is really very nicely decorated here. It's got sago palms and little leaf palms and heaven knows what else. And there's the driveway in on the other side. This is the house directly next door. And they have a beach access, right? And they look out their front window here. And they look right onto the beach. Expecting anybody? This is the last no. night. And taking some sleeping, sleeping pills. She was groggy. She was in no shape to see anyone. Just to put that. Been right inside Did she ever talk room. about suicide? Why would Evie be coming no. out to see this? Well, Auntie, what do you got? TV. Raiden pulled some nice prints off the door and opened her pregnancy. More yeah. up. Physical arguments. God, no, I, I didn't mean to give you a long impression. I, I just overheard a phone call. She was pretty furious. Watch him. Why make trouble Reiner. for the man? He's a whole other generation. I can just imagine what he went through being a black kid in Tennessee in the 50s. And a little later. It's uh, Friday morning and we're getting ready to go. And I just thought I'd take a little picture of the unit before we left. So that when we come back, we'll see what changes they've made because we never seem to remember. Uh, the kitchen looks as good as ever. You've got this nice bright white, it stays white. Here's the uh, guest bedroom. Little bathroom. Here they've done that. And here's the bedroom. And the bathroom. We have changed the uh, shower curtain in here. Not the wallpaper. This seems like a pretty big mess. There are some great trees here. Uh, this is one that I particularly really like. And just down the road from it is this one. Also, quite spectacular with all that stuff hanging off of it. That's the employee's such a bad thing. I've got all this wonderful mask. I don't know if This is in Fort Myers, and uh, to our left is. is uh, Walmart and then just beside it is Home Depot. But they go crazy with lights here. We've never seen so many lights at an intersection. And there may Well, September the 25th and we are at church. So is the crowd. Uh, we're going to go for the lesson of the day. Today, May 13th, 9th, or 2001. Oh, and look at who's come to visit. Hello, baby. Oh, 
the shirt is so like air. Everybody's having fun. It's such a lovely day. The body part is so big. It feels a happy face. And here's the bee. There was a dead grasshopper in the a, last one. And what there was? A dead grasshopper. Is that what was making that? How did you get him out? With a stick. With a stick? Yeah. Now where is he? Huh? In the pool someplace? I don't know. Me and Sarah, she's watching. Okay, baby, now I'm going to take a good picture of you, but I bet the sun is in your eye. Okay. Oh. 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 Well, hello there. Do you do have your first, your first dip in the pool? You said, put me back in again. Yeah. I think you like it. It's okay, you said. You have others in the pool. You know, that can. Then we're going to come and take him for a dip. Maybe it's too cold for him, do you think, Jennifer? You wait, you wait. Baby's first, dip in the pool. And he might be, 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 become an Olympic swimmer. And if he is, I'll get, I'll get, I'll get the, I'll get the tape, I'll, get, I'll have the tape. And when he's an Olympic swimmer, guess what's going to happen? I'll get royalties on it. Oh, he seems to like that. He didn't scream. wait. Yeah. Why don't you guys swim here? This is barbecue. Oh, I think the river is very busy over here. I don't know what he's doing, but it's whatever it is. No. Today is May 15th. It's 4.30 in the afternoon. We told Jimmy we'd be here at 4.30. We're here. And we're at the Grand Canyon. We checked into the hotel. We're now going to the trailhead to see if we can pick him up. Here's another view of the Grand Canyon. Nice time in the day. You can see all the shadows. Now here's some, some of this trail. You can see it. You can see people walking up the trail on the other side. People come through this little hole in the oh. cliff. Right up to the top of the trail. This is a terrible picture because of the sun. But you can see you have to walk all the way up in donkey do. Let me stick it here, hold this to right. Sure. The lone trees or something. Not funny how those little trees just grow right out of the rock? Yeah, I know. Wouldn't it, would it be funny if I got a shot of Jimmy coming up here? It's 
same day, about six o'clock or close to six. I just saw Jim go in through this little hole in here. And I thought he'd be coming out the other end, but I sure don't see him yet. Unless he met somebody he knew in that tunnel. Here I see him coming back out now. I don't know how. There he is. Always by himself. Didn't find James yet. there yet. Yeah, it's starting to get dark. Well, I hope he gets out of there before it gets too dark. But I would imagine you could still. Manage quite nicely the last part of this trip in the dark, don't you think, Jim? Be no problem? Well, he's still got, got another hour of light. Hour. Visitor come along here. Yes, so I you just you can go. He says, I'm gonna go up this trail. Oh my goodness. I don't want to get stuck and get and get uh, and get run run down by a deer. Where did he go? He's, he's standing right there. I think you should uh, he's gonna go up the hill. You think so? I don't know where he's gonna go. I think he's lost. Oh, he's going down the side of the mountain. Yeah, there's some big ice coming up with the backpack there. Yeah, I know. It's just why I just finished that. Yeah. the next morning today is what May 16th yep. and Jimmy is half recovered he could get his shoes back on we found out why we couldn't recognize Jimmy because he has his hat <coughs> anyway it's a gorgeous day we get ready to leave 
Here we are down at the <coughs> east end. Somebody built something here. There's the hiker and he seems to be okay. No money on me. Huh? You can look in my camera here, you can see just as good if not better. Go across this way, it's interesting too. Panoramic view. No, no. This is another view from that. Funny, now get up funny uh, Mesa kind of thing. Or oh, you can sure see it for a long ways. Here we are at the little Grand Canyon. Here are the two explorers. I'm just give you an idea of what this area is like. It's pretty green at this time of year. Here's some of the flowers that are blooming out here that you just don't notice. And you get up close. And come there over here. And watch it bloom and close up. Funny area that we're going through right now. This is called the Painted Desert. This is the Painted Desert? Yeah, right. Well, but look at the paint. It does. I look at the colors that you can see over in the distance. but I'm taking a picture of this canyon, too. And here's the Colorado River. And there's the bridge. And here's the other bridge. That two bridge. Here's a view where, just at the beginning of where Jim years ago started his uh, cruise down, cruise, 
boat trip down the river. And boy, is it warm here. Isn't that pretty? More pictures down here. Huh? What does that signify? There's Jimmy and Jim. Huh? The current? Power. I mean, look look right behind here. It's going over something. You don't want to be in there, see? Oh, yeah. This is the river. And here are the uh, vermilion cliffs. James started his trek across the canyon, the North Kebab Trail, and it is uh, 14 miles from the canyon rim to the Colorado River. From Murray Springs to the river, it follows the trace of Bright Angel Fault, but they say a warning here. Never try to hike from the rim to the river and back in one day. Many who tried suffered serious illness or death. Anyway, that's his trip and he's done it and he's happy. He's finished. And here we are in the parking lot and Jim spent the night in his truck before he started that hike down the trail. But it is beautiful now. But Awfully bright. Yeah. Yeah. I am taking pictures. I can't see here. And I might say, hey, did you buy it? Did you win a prize? And yeah, those are not good. here into the bird area. <laughs> I really don't have any bird blood like Jimmy and Jim do. Spectacular view here. I mean, just, I'm not doing very well at taking these pictures because my hands are still sweaty. On the other side, completely on the other side, yes. There's not. Up at the top of Angels. Yeah. Point, whatever. Viewpoint. Um, yeah, it's only, it's not like on the creek, but it's within a uh, hundred feet of it for actually um, at least half of the distance. Cool. Yeah. What, what did you say? Didn't know. Karen doesn't know. My dad's not. Like Car right, right at Bright Angel Vault. You can look down here and see where James went yesterday and back up on the other side. At the mountain, but it's kind of dark over there now, so. Here's Jim reading his book at the Grand Canyon Lodge. Here's this big, huge fireplace they have here. This is the library in the lodge. <coughs> A great view. Very comfortable. He has his talks in the evening. When was this built, Jimmy? And here's the view out here. And there's where Jim was sitting reading his book. Okay. I 
things that no, you'll need to do that. Now, later on in the day. Really? And we're going to have a barbecue. I mean, since I can remember, my, I can that all go to kind of like feel like they're a little bit, uh, feel yeah. a little impediment. You can go yeah. like that and it's, and it's not. Mm -hmm. Trees across the way are really pretty. Look at those aspen trees. Quakey, so. This is May 17th, and we're in Zion National Park at the new visitor center with James. And we're getting ready to go on a short tour and a little hike. This is behind the new museum that will be opening in 2002. There's an, an outdoor dining area and this is an example of the bathroom. Another beautiful area. And this is looking the other way. There's no way you can get any kind of perspective of this at all. Oh, here's this nice dining room. Oh, great. James has finished his lunch. We all had a nice lunch and now we're going to the end of the pool. This is a beautiful thing on the way to the end of the This is just a little the cactus that must be not more than two inches. And here's another one. Now this is a big one. This one must be about three inches across. These are on the trail up to the Emerald Pool. Here's another. This is like we across a little stream. And there's a big arch here. Huge. And then you go up this way, and you look and see where we are. We're approaching the Emerald Pools. Here's some more flowers growing along the edge, except you can see how they're growing right along the edge. Again. They're acting like mountain goats. And uh, we're just at the bottom of this huge slab of rock. We go across here. A little tributary of the Virgin River. And the, but this is how this whole canyon looks. It's really very beautiful. Of course, this is the perfect time of year to be here. That's this time because that's when a tornado ripped down all the trees in France. That's correct. <laughs> we were on the Eiffel Tower. On the Eiffel Tower when the, when the tornado came through. This is where we brought you across to. Pull her off the thing? I'm telling you, one of the guys was holding her. He was holding <laughs> on to a post and hanging on to me. I looked and I thought, boy, there's a big storm coming. And I thought, well, I have to go to the can. Now's a good time. So I went to the can. Well, and so stay behind this chain. Blink. Or what did ever chain rope? And this is usually full of water. Oh, so you can come this way when it's really raining a lot. I've been listening to the computer show and they say, oh, it's horrible. Uh, there's, a, there's, there's groups. Use that groups. AOL sucks. News group. That's just gorgeous back there. This is at the back of the water, other waterfall, and one we could see. It's really pretty in here. She was trying to lure me in here and walk, walk across this river on a log. 
but I don't think so. Come from up here on the top, and now we're coming down. And this is interesting, I'm walking from the block. And here you can see the water coming down on the side. It's very pretty. And here are my companions. The mountain goats. They can go so quickly and I have to go one little step at a time. Trying to go under the waterfall. You can see how the water just turns. I got that and we stand here. I'm very nervous on this rock. There's nothing to keep them from falling into the crevasse below. If they do, we won't help. See this here? They have the algae down there? Yeah. We're in the park on the bus. There's a snake. And, uh, we finished our hike up to the Emerald Pools. Now we're going to the back to the other end of the park. We're going to get off and look at angels. Look at an angels on the The big band stop. We are in this area where there's uh, where Jimmy bikes, and here's a really pretty purple sagebrush. Jim, James has taken us out to where he motorbikes. No, not motorbikes. This is not motorbiking. This is where he does his uh, mountain biking. He sold his motorbike, and. Uh, Are these really pretty flowers here? I don't know what they are. And then right here on the side of the road was one of these, which I really wanted to take a close up of. And I took a close up and got too close. And there you can see it. It's really pretty. There's two of them. And then there's the river. This is another part of the trail that Jimmy rides along. Here he is with his dad. Here, Mr. Lizard, I'm coming up and I'm going to take a picture of you. I found it. It's got several stripes of orange. Did you zoom in on him? Yeah. Can you see the orange? No, because my picture is not in color. Oh. He's up there, he's looking around, he's saying, Oh, somebody's looking at me. He's hard to spot almost. Yeah. Let me show my asses. Scars. Uh, here's the Virgin River. Another view of it. And uh, 
it's uh, doing its work. It's digging down to the ground. You get a really good view out here, Dad. Don't go out there. Can you stop standing on the edges? I don't want to. I don't like that at all. Get away from there. I hate to be the one to take a picture of you tumbling off the edge. Look, that's that. Here are some more pictures of the river and the environment around it. It's very pretty. And that's back. Nine, nine meters part. per second squared, right? Hey, who's going? We can't give any alcohol wipes or a, or a, we got paper towels. Uh, yeah, no. Who's the food talking? Who's the food? Well, it looks like these guys have a little bottle. Yeah. Oh, that's not very deep. Huh? Oh, it's way deep over there where they're jumping. It doesn't look pretty, but there's like deep spots. Oh. You know exactly where they are. Here's the last house that Jimmy and Kelly built. Did a nice job on it. They also built the house next door. And here's going up to the front door. There's a new porch here. Here's our living room with two fans. Laundry room. Nice kitchen. Gee, there's a lot of kitchen space in here. Really, a lot of good cupboards. This is cost a lot to hang. Probably because of the heat and that. Mm -hmm. A nice stove. And here's the master bedroom. And it's got a nice fan too. And a walk-in closet. You notice on top of the walls here, there's plant hanger things. And here's the master bathroom. Got a nice shower. Very nice bathroom. Powder room here. A nice little bedroom here. Linen closet. And then the Probably. Well, we've got Jim's relatives here. And here we are, we're going into the hotel. We're going to lunch here. <laughs> okay. We're told that I get it. Let you take your glasses off. Okay, so we'll recognize you when you come to visit us. <laughs> I carried that little guy around in my yard. Uh -huh. Oh, you did, Joe, too? Yeah, I, 
carried him. Oh my goodness, that is. Yeah, well, you know, what we could do is go to San Diego. Yeah. And then cruise up to uh, church. And I'll see you. Take care, mother. Take care, mother, honey. Stop at the green tree in. <laughs> Well, that's this. And We're just coming home now. It's 7:37. Friday night. We hope you have a good Gizzy, look at this. Look at look me in the face. That's it. You say anything? There's his big bushy tail. What do we have here? My goodness. Go? Look at that. He says, look at the camera. Are you going to stand up for Grandma? No. Or Great Grandma? He's going to crawl around. He's going to crawl. Right here. Well, are you ever getting mobile fast? Uh oh. Gizmo, come here. Say yeah. hi, sweetheart. Come here, Gizmo. Look at that. What a good picture of you. Let's see a smile. He knows. I'm standing to camera. He wants to smile for it. He says, I'm going to go crawl up on a grandma at CD. Oh, I'm standing up. Look at this. Hey, just, whoa. There's four crawlers over there. He's gonna go find you know where he's this. going to? Oh, he loves a cat. He, he loves, loves a cat. cat. <laughs> Poor cat. <laughs> Be nice to the cat this time. Cat's that way. You said no. I can get out of the window and I can stand up over there too. You can stand, stand up. up. Well, how are you? Stand how are you guys all? Good. Yeah. Everybody fine? Uh, yeah. <laughs> There you go. You stand now, huh? Hey, what's the dog? He's coming along with Yeah. Oh, yeah. he's talking too. Oh, dad, 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 dad. Guess where the cat is? He's found the best place. He said, I'm not coming out. <laughs> he said, I've had experience with kids. I know, a brand new fellow one. Here, look at that smile. Come on, go get the camera. She's got a lens cap, huh? Go play with the lens on He's the like, camera. He's like, there's Chris. He said, no, I've got lots of places to go to here. This is new territory. <laughs> I'm going to get up on the chair. Oh, there he goes, up on the chair now. And you know, you'll say, look uh -oh. back on this, Jennifer. You know what you're going to say? Uh-oh. God. Looking at their little feet. In the water. Kick your feet. Splash, splash. He knows about splashing, huh? Splash, splash. Splishy splash. Yes, we make it splashes. Uh, we splash our feet. Yay. Uh, Yay. How about a big smile for Grandma right now? A big smile. Look here. Look. <gasps> Brandon. Oh, you want to put your hands in there, too, huh? <laughs> <laughs> you just want to get in there and That's stop. funny. It's not too cold. It's kind of nice. <laughs> I have this bathing suit. It's too cold. There's in. Oh, he's so much fun. Splashing. 
Can you spell some more? Oh, go great. Good. Brandon's splashing. Oh, dear. Now I can send pictures to Annie Helen. Maybe he can fix the fire, the, the other thing too. The one that attaches the camera to the computer. Hey. Gosh! What didn't you bring? They brought the play can, they brought everything. Look at this. He's eating a cookie. <laughs> Just imagine. Once I'm sorry to show this picture to him when he's 25 years old. And say, look at you eating a cookie. He's like, I had blood in my well, I will be 85 years old. Wow. Wow. Can you imagine that? Look at the age difference we have between us. 65 years almost. He don't know what it's like to be old. Here's William. Look at him. William, stand up for a minute, because I want to take the picture. Okay. How you are. <laughs> he shrunk. He shrunk. He thought he got to stand beside the door. And then I can see. If you go, if you stand beside the door. No. See, this is him on his knees. Okay, now. Okay. Pan away. Let's see if he grew in the few minutes that I've got back here. Oh, let's see. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> I ate a foot. Oh, let's pan away again. Let's see what else we have. Oh, and he's still not up there. How tall do you think he can grow to? I think he's gone to five foot. Five. Oh, my goodness. He's just stretched. Oh, I can't believe and look at this cat. See what the cat's doing? Oh, where's the cat? Wait, no, just a second. You got, uh, just a second. He wants a treat. He wants a treat. Kitty wants a treat. Okay. No. Our cat, he's going to have his face, but he's going to have his hair all cut on uh, Monday. Yeah, it, yeah, Gizzy. You know, I'm going to art school and I'm going to learn how to paint, make oil paintings now. Yeah. And my first subject is, guess who's my first subject? Sasquatch. Well, he's gonna, he's gonna. When you see that, yeah, aren't they cute? See when they cut his, when they cut his fur before, they left it go along on his feet. That's why it looks like he's got moccasins on. You should leave. Daddy, give some to Daddy. Brandon. See, down here he is doing it, and since I take one, take a picture, he's not gonna do it. Give me food. There. <laughs> Is that pretty good, huh? He says, a bite for me. How about a bite for daddy? Bite for daddy. <laughs> you need another cracker? Brandon? Is that good? Oh, yum, yum. Oh, I can hear a crunch. <laughs> yeah, now you put it in Daddy's mouth. Well, isn't that a good boy? Isn't that a good boy? Good boy, huh? He's so good. He's a... Let's see your one tooth. Let's go. You got one tooth? Oh, he's found my camera lens. <laughs> lens cover. A lens cover. Is that what that is? It's a lens cover. But I still like it the way you feed your daddy. Give your daddy another. No, lens cap. I can work that. I can work that. At school, we have a switcher. You know, it's got all the buttons, and you put, you know, camera one on one mm -hmm. and camera two on the other, and he'll he'll do dissolves back and forth with a little knob. Mm -hmm. Just sit there all day, back and Ready forth, to back and forth. Where's my food? Okay, I get it. I think we have Christopher in this wonderful outfit. He's going to hide. He's going to hide. Chris, do the Amy Jasper run. Do the Amy Jasper run. Yeah. I can't believe he's hiding. 
How am I ever going to make any money on these pictures, Christopher, if you're hiding all the time? Brandon, okay, uh, Jennifer. Uh, 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 okay, let's see, do it again, do it again. Louder. You better be careful because I think you're talking in code. <laughs> what color are your eyes, Brandon? What color are those great big dark eyes there? Are they brown? Tooth. Let me see his tooth. Probably related to them somehow. Where's your tooth? I don't think so because... You want to show it? Oh, how, how, what color is eyes? I can't figure out what color is eyes. Well, it's October the 25th. It's quite nice today. In fact... It's very nice today. Here's Linda. She's got her. She's got her lot in life. Now she's studying Sunset Magazine. She's going to redesign my back. And here's a little little uh, kitty. Hello, kitty. How are you? Let's see your fur. Because in a week, your know, fur will be a lot thicker. Look at me. Yeah, yeah, look at. It's still October the 25th, and now we're at Helen's. And we've been for a walk through her little um, fruit area with her lemon trees and her grapefruits. And, and here's her new little sculpture she has at the end of her driveway. They don't turn out very good looking this way. But... Everything's growing really well. Everybody else has gone in the house. So, I guess I will too. Here are the frogs that Bob bought for me. Two effing frogs, as he says. Everything is looking so beautiful. It's that time of year. And in the distance, you can see other houses, but nothing too close. Uh, this is a, a plant that Jim is interested in picking up. I'll just take a close-up of it. He's going to go to the nursery and try and find some. It's a vine, and it's pretty clean, and it likes a little bit of shade. Not a whole snapper, but no. here's one of Helen's uh, cats. Is this squeaks or purrs? That's uh, squeaky. Purrs is squeaky. Hey, squeaky? Come here. Well, she's letting me take her picture. Is he being home for a while? No, you were lost. His wife. Yeah, we're in Helen's kitchen. They got married because they used uh, to get shipped out. So I made all this pineapple. And Helen's oh, made some ice cubes. So is it pineapple and cherries? Pineapple and raspberries. That's right. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> So that, so when you see a lump in your iced tea, you know it's not. Lots of guys, yeah. And here we're looking out of the kitchen window. We put it in the kitchen. And it's very nice. And the cats have disappeared again. So much fun. To Tom, see is this supposed oh, to be a penned in area yeah, with the cat? Yeah. Like earlier, because I can see, see that's not going to last. They just, long. The, the, on Tuesday, she told. They'll climb over that in a minute. Flight. Your dog saw a cat. Kitty, 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 kitty. Here you go. Here, look at She's not going to do this. Come on. Be good. There you are. Oh, look at this. I'm just scared of it. Oh, yeah. There. Okay, now I'll put her outside so there's a reward. Come on, honey. Oops. Give her a treat. Yeah, give her a treat. There, now that's better. Look at me, kitty. Kitty. That's a good kitty. That's, uh, That's a good kitty. Here's Jim in the morning. It's not early in the morning. It's 9.30. And he's at his usual book thing. And here's our view. 
patio. Golf course in the background. I'm over there at the ocean. You can see it right now. And here's our inside. I think I took a picture before. Our dining room in the kitchen area. Here, here. Well, I can't see because you're with the lights in the background. But here's Linda. Oh, she's got a view too. And her double bed. Oh, you can see the fountain here. It's a gorgeous view. Gorgeous view. We can just go out and sit in the patio if you, you want to. Yeah, I was sitting out there already. We're now in the pool area outside of the concierge area, and here's where they have all their exercise equipment, which is very nice. And here's the pool. go back and clean my camera. I can't believe how <laughs> dirty it is. I think, hope it's not coming out that way. The resort here. Oh yeah. And I'm sure that will be. We're in the adult pool area. Here's the adult pool area. I like this little thing they have. Mm -hmm. A little sunshade. And here's a weird tree with a an ugly it's an ugly pink almost brown flower. Kind of a rusty. Yeah. Oh yeah. These here's some really interesting turtle turtle fountain. I know we saw them at the show, but not this big. It's all spitting in a little pot. I really like this little fountain. Well, uh, this is a hole here. Filled with that, and the turtles spin in it. You know what Jimmy would let me run when it comes to Thanksgiving. I get Bob to get me the turtles. Actually, you could do it without turtles. You could do it with anything. Here's the view from the 